Pussy Willows. There were some Pussy Willows there. Pussy Willows. Wow. How did I miss that for years? There's, there's a house there, a building, a structure. How about that? That looks like the top of a uh, minuet. Um, you know, those bulbish, coming to a point shapes at the top of the towers, popular in, uh, let's see, Russia. Pick up a hitchhiker. <laughs> Both. Okay. What do you do? What do you do? You lift this? Oh. Um, and forward. Um, I don't no. think it goes forward enough. Huh? I mean, that's as far no. forward as it goes. You can yeah. go around either way. No problem. Okay. okay. How about the front? Who's going to be in the front? I don't I don't. Can one of us sit in the front? Oh, yeah. um, well, Donna, can't you just crouch here in the middle? I can't get in. What do you mean? You can't get in? Come back here. Just crowd, just, just sit, just sit you on the... Can, if, the usual path is meant to go we'll like go that. Can you go through the middle? Give me the I, mail, Donna. Give me I the mail. I think I can. Um, I hope. I'm in. Okay. Oh, okay. Beautiful. I'm in. Thank you. Where are you, are you headed? Winthrop. That's where we're going. You know Winthrop Auto? Um. Uh, <laughs> you will now. Oh, <laughs> you're going to close the door. Huh? Oh yeah, the door on the side. Well, <laughs> Donna. Turn around and close it. Okay. Yeah. Hey. Okay, boy. This is an operation and a half, huh? It is, it is. But we'll get there, right? Yeah. yeah. You bet. Thank you, sir. Where you, you're from? Oh, you're from up there? Yeah. yeah. Yes. Went through it. Good. I got my plates for the other car. Good. Go see my insurance van. Yeah. Transfer. Then hitchhike back. But no, I won't have to. If the car's no, ready. You'll have your car. He said the car's ready. Yeah. Let me get something to drink here. Uh, come on. Where's the uh Where's the other thing, Donna? So how old are your children? Oh, I, I've got a 17-year-old and a 16-year-old. Ah. Wow. And then we right. decide to start again. So oh. I got a five-year-old and a three-year-old. Oh, well, that's Lord. good. Yeah, yeah. You must enjoy children. Ah. We do. We well, do. That, that's good. Yeah, that's great. Good. You're getting a nice raising up here in Maine, huh? They are. Ah. You're from Maine? Um, originally, I'm from New Hampshire. What town? Uh, Troy, which is just south of Key. I live there. Yeah. Where about? Troy, Troy Fitzwilliam. Yeah. Uh, Benning. Let's see. No, I lived in Bennington too, and in uh, Antrim, and yeah. Troy. I, used, I lived in J uh, the Jaffrey, uh, Hinsdale, uh, Win uh, Winchester, yeah. and I would uh, drive through Troy. There's, you, you turn the corner there. There's a sharp corner like this. Yeah. You know, and I had a, a friend who lived right in the house at the corner there. It's all run down, big, the whole huge house. <laughs> yep. There's some yep. stores right there. There's a corner like this. Troy to it. Unbelievable. 
Yeah. And you're from there? That's your hometown? That's my hometown. Yeah. Well, mine's Claremont. Yep. Hers is me in, well, Goffstown. Yeah. She was born in a hospital in the town of Grasmere. Yeah, there was a hospital over there, Jethro Moore Hospital, and I was born there. Yes. I would just met somebody at a conference at UMA over the weekend on changing Maine. He's from uh, Weir, New Hampshire. Huh. Mm-hmm. And she still lives in Berlin, New Hampshire. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm, I'm over here, hanging around. As soon as I get this car fixed up, by uh, Thursday, I gotta go to a dentist in Portland tomorrow to get a, a new tooth put on. Yeah. I just came from a dentist in Lewis and having stitches removed. Right. Mm. From my tongue. That was a heck of an experience. Do a biopsy on each side of my tongue. Come to find out it's not cancer. Well, that's good news. It just sticks in. Yeah. That turned white. And they found that over 15 years ago. My grandma had to submit to the biopsy. The dentist put the cancer scare into me. Mm-hmm. Now I don't have to worry about that. And then from Portland, I'll probably keep right on going. See, up to New I Hampshire. told you, you didn't have cancer. No, that's right. I do. No. You don't let me know. Huh? You run this road a lot? No, no. Usually I'm heading huh. north from Winthrop, but I was down seeing a dentist. <laughs> not not get back. Oh, yeah. What? Yeah. You were just at Kip Banks's. Yeah. We were in the next room to each other. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. All right. How do you... you have a tube pulled or something? Tube teeth pulled? Yeah. Yep. That and, and you're okay? You're, oh, you're yeah. talking and smiling? Yeah. <laughs> it's nothing. They just go pink, pink, and they're out. Now, did you find him rough or rough or cold or any uh, mistreatment involved? He is highly efficient. And you gotta think of the clientele he serves. <laughs> Which is yes, what? I mean, yes. People like you and I? <laughs> and the only way, I mean, just in the area that he's in. And, and he, he's one of the few dentists who will take an adult who's on main care or, or on uh, Medicare. He's one of the few dentists in the area who does that. He's and the only oral surgeon in Lewiston. And if you're working for government reimbursement rates, the only way you're gonna make any money at it yep. is to do is about just bang, 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 get it done. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And he really just doesn't spend any time on building a relationship with you or making you feel comfortable. That's because right. We all know what you're here for, yep. and we all know why you're here for mm-hmm. it, so we're all just going <laughs> to dispense with the pleasantries and get it done. Oh, you got him figured out to a D. I take it you, this was not your first time. No. He did my wisdom teeth back in my early 20s. Mm, 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 mm. Well, he committed a medical malpractice against me. He cut my lip right here. Oh, yeah? With that electric knife. And there was blood everywhere and I was screaming. Yeah. When he pulled it out of my tongue, it went whoop like that. Yeah. Today the music wasn't on, Donna. It? it was on, but not oh. loud. Oh, I couldn't hear. It. The TV was on. Anyway, at any rate, I made a complaint against him. Well, here's what I did first. I googled his name yep. to look up the address. I wasn't even trying to dig up dirt on this guy. Yep. So I'm not telling you what to do, sir. <laughs> but if you are curious, you might want to Google Kipex. That's all you're going to put in there. And about 37. Dreams of shit come up about this guy. Yep. He's been in all kinds of trouble. 37 complaints. Oh, my aching back. So, yeah, he gives up. He's, for efficiency, he's sacrificing a normal dentist practice 
and he's pushing. Yeah, you, you're right. He, exactly. You got it. And that's yep. half the problem. Now, it's not... This auto mechanic, he just opened up last month. This guy, they all charge $50 an hour, too. That guy, that guy. And the one I'm going to is up beyond that Hannaford Distribution Center. Right. He's actually, like, right in front of that Hannaford Distribution Center. Yeah. Yeah. So I've got a complaint against him, which he already got a copy. I did it online. Yeah. And he says, everybody here knows there's a complaint against you. Me, rather. And he says, can I take pictures of you today? I says, by all means, I, I welcome you taking pictures. Because I want that little cut to show. There's a little scar in the corner of my mouth. Yeah. And he took pictures of the stitches in the tongue that operation. This one or yeah. the one? Yeah, this guy. Okay. No, oh no, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm, yeah. I'm not in yeah. my own car. Yeah. That's okay. That's okay. I, I, that's okay. I'm never a passenger in another person's car, so I get it's, very it's confused. This. This guy. Where the guy yeah. tried to have this the... Guy, right, right, right. right what, what did this guy do? What did oh, he, he do? tried. He tried to open up a coffee shack. Yeah. He tried a guitar business, a musical instrument business. Nothing works. Yeah. Nothing. Well, nobody wants to stop at this point on 202. Who, who, who's, yeah, who needs a cup of coffee? There's my car. There you go. I'm sitting right there. They want their money. Now they want about $500. That's right. Thank you. That's Amen. right. Wow. Uh, Thank you so much for that list. Yeah. Appreciate it. Have a great day. You too. Well, though, nice to meet another uh, New Hampshire native. Oh. Donna, oh. It, yeah. Just push the gas tank in. No, it's not the gas tank. Oh, it is. It is. Oh, it is. Is that strange or not? It won't. <laughs> Oh, it it's, it's to keep you from opening the door on the gas nozzle. Yeah, boy, they got that. That's good. Yeah, yeah. You have a nice day. Jesus. You too. You, oh, here's your receipt. There, there. Yep. there you go. Thank you. Have you a good one. me. I keep them there too. Thank you very much. <laughs> oh, it's been forever since I've given a ride to a hitchhiker. That was fun. And I think it was rather funny that... Uh, that we were coming from the same place. I think it's funny there's a for sale sign on the car he said that was his. Don't know, don't care. They're where they want to be. And I left before they can say they want to go somewhere.